Uh, which one? Yeah, right there. I want y'all see that map right there? Y'all see Kazaria, right? I want y'all to, y'all see the Black Sea and the Caspian Sea, right? The reason I want to highlight those two seas is because all the names around them have been changed pretty much. But the names of the Black Sea and the Caspian Sea is still the same today. Give me the next map on Russia crisis. Give me the next map. Yep. Hey, hey, y'all see Black Sea? Black Sea. Black Sea right there. And right over to the right is the Caspian Sea right side. Caspian Sea, blue, blue. Caspian Sea, Black Sea. Okay, you see Black Sea, Caspian Sea. Now Kazaria is right above that. Look, look where Kazaria is. Ukraine, Ukraine, and Russia. All of that is Kazaria, all of that. Hey, give me uh, Wikipedia, type in, uh, not type in, I gave it to you, Tonga, uh, I, uh, right there. Read that. Tomga. Tomga or Tamaga literally means stamp or seal in Mongolian and designates emblematic symbols which were... Now, that's all I wanted. Tomga means a seal or a symbol, right? Give me... That's a Khazar's hat. Give me the next one. Right there. Read that. The current shield and symbol of Ukraine. The crest of Ukraine. Crest of Ukraine corresponds to the so-called Khazarian Tumga symbol or Tumga Jazaro belonging to the old Khazarian Empire belonging to the old Khazarian Empire from where the Khazarian Mafia arises and originates y'all see that? this is them this is them I can't get a bomb can I get, can I get a bomb over here? give me the next picture now we'll look but look I don't care about the, the title. Look in the background. You see the symbol right there on the wall. Give me the next one, the next picture. Look on the flag. Look at the flag. It's the same symbol from old Kazaria. Yes, he's Jewish. Amalek. Give me the next one. Look right there. Pull it back out, not too close. I want people to see it. That's the same old Khazarian symbol, the Tamga. That's them. Give me the next one with America. You see how America backs them? You see how America backs them? Why? Because they're all in it together. Now, give me the video. It says uh, Ukraine Trident National Symbol. It's a, it's a link, I believe. It might be. I'm not sure if it's a video. Let me look. It's, it's, a, it's an article. Nope, nope, nope. It's an article. It says Ukraine President Vladimir. It's a link. It says Ukraine. It's RFE slash R. Yeah, that's it right there. <laughs> now, you see the symbol once again right there. Let's go through it. Raise it up. They want to upgrade the Trident emblem. Go ahead, raise it up. Raise it up. This is their symbol. No, no, wait, wait. You see that, oh, that cross right there? Y'all ever seen that cross right there before? Germany wore that cross. That's the German cross. Raise it up. Raise it up. They're looking. Up. Now, this is the old member. That, that, this is the ancient one. They, they dug it up. Y'all can still make it out, right? That's it right there. Raise it up. Uh, on that picture they're holding on the top left, you see it right there? It's right there. Yep, that's it. Okay, raise it up. Right there on the flag right there. This is the Khazar Empire. Raise it up. Yep, with the pull it back down with the German cross right there on the jacket. German cross. Raise it up. These are your old Nazis. This is them. There's the Khazar symbol. Raise it up. Hanging it up. Hey, hey, Bishop. So yes, when, 
Putin say he fighting Nazis. He knows something that we just finding out. That's right. Exactly. Right? Like you said, Putin said it on national TV. He said, I'm fighting Nazis. America was like, no, no, don't listen to him. He's crazy. Like, he's not crazy. And a lot of you black men ran over there to protect these people. And they hate your guts. I'm going to show you that too. Raise it up. Was that it? Yeah, that was it. Give me the next one. Uh, it's a TikTok. TikTok video. You can X out of that. Uh, yeah. Put it on the screen over there. I want some volume. No problem. No problem. No problem. No problem. Do y'all see what he did? He smacked him and made him take a banana, calling him what? A monkey. That's what he's doing. Give me the next video. Hey, hey, uh, yeah, give me the next one. Yeah, that one. Yep. Start at the two. How long is that? How long? Start at 2.34. Two minutes, 34 seconds. Pay close attention. It's the Thanks Ukraine. Inside the disc. Many of the students we spoke to said they'd come south to the Hungarian border because of phone footage like this from border crossings into Poland. Videos purporting to show foreigners being treated differently by Ukrainian border guards at the long queues going west into Poland, something the UN's High Commissioner for Refugees has acknowledged was happening. Augustine's university lectures for medicine were due to start properly in March. Aspirations derailed for now by war. Well, you understand the it, these, they're there for, to learn medicine, to become doctors. I want y'all to understand, don't look at them and be like, oh, those are homeless people. No, no, no. They were in, these are students in school to become doctors. Go ahead, play on. Aspirations derailed for now by war. At the border crossing he first went to, he says there was a policy of large groups of black people being separated from Ukrainians. Did somebody actually say that to you? How do you know that that was the case? <laughs> they didn't actually say it, but we could observe it. In what way? How did you observe that? Mm -mm. We saw, like, we were in the queue. At first, blacks were, it wasn't like that. We were all moving together. That it got to a time, blacks were somewhere else, and other, let me see, other white colored skin were also somewhere else, and they were actually moving a little bit faster. The blacks weren't going at all. Did they separate the queues? Yes. So black people were in one queue and white people were in another queue? Mm -hmm. Black people are eventually getting across into Poland though, but unlike Ukrainians who are being picked up by friends and family, foreign students, for example, have to wait longer at places like Pyszemysz in Poland. Właśnie odprowadzamy pana, który chodzi po przemyślu bez dokumentów. Nie wiem po co. Żadnych dokumentów. Last night, patrols from the Polish far right confronted refugees in that town. In one case, chasing groups of black people through the street. In normal times, people from African nations would need to apply for Schengen visas to go from Ukraine to Poland. But because of the war, there's now no visa requirement on anyone entering countries like Poland from Ukraine. In a statement, the Ukrainian foreign ministry said there was a first come, first serve policy at the border independent of race or nationality. They also said that because of active fighting, they were encouraging foreign students to stay in their place of residence. This carriage is full of young Moroccans, all from the same faculty of medicine at Kharkiv University. Full of dreams dashed. The war shattered our dreams. We, we, we don't know what's going to happen to us. We can't know what, what, are we going to be a future doctors or not. Did you always want to be a doctor? Yes. Yes, since, since I was skip a child. Skip it up ahead, let me see something. And uh, our skip parents... Skip it up ahead. Skip it up, skip it up, skip it up. Okay, give me the next video. Hey, give me the next hey, video. Hey, Bishop, yes, can sir. I say something? Yeah. 
for those of you Negro Christians, let me tell you how stupid you are. Do you guys know that since this war started with Russia and Ukraine, Fine. Joe Biden gave Ukraine at least $150 billion, mm -hmm. counting. And the war is not even still over. Now, you know this what the Democrats is pushing in the community now? They're pushing, uh, what you call that thing? Uh, uh, six, uh, four K and a meal. What you call that? Of reparation. Reparation. You, 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 and some of them fall for it. Mm -hmm. You know why they're pushing it? Because they know your Negroes the one who put Joe Biden in office, and Joe Biden did nothing. So now they're pushing on it. Why your guys? They think they're pushing it. So your guys can vote for them again. Yep. And after they vote for them, guess what they're gonna say? Oh, we put it. We put it in Congress. It just didn't pass. And your Negroes continue for for the same okie dokie. Yep. Exactly. Go ahead. Next video. Pay attention. I'm, I'm a lady, they might let me in. So I was right Wait, wait, she I said, I'm a lady, they might let me in. Go back, go back, go ahead, play it. I'm, I'm a lady, they might let me in. So I was right there by the steps, and um, the guy by the train, I don't know what they're called. Yeah, this guy literally, he's a big man, he pushed me off the steps. And then I tried to get on again, he pushed me, but he kept saying, ladies first, ladies first. So I looked at him and said, I'm a lady, and he just stared at me and looked away. Made way, and uh, he let uh, Ukrainian women pass, only Ukrainian women. There was another black lady behind me, I don't know, I do not know her, but uh, the two of us were standing right there and watching all this happen. So we could do nothing, and we just stood there and looked. The guy closed the door, we tried to rush to the next wagon, same thing was happening. So the, uh, the train just, um, the train just left us. Yeah. Well, I was just, I was shocked because I did not know the extent of the racism. I did not know. I thought maybe, okay, fine, I'm a lady. So obviously they'll let me in because that's the rule. So I just, I was in shock. I was shocked. I was shocked. I wasn't even afraid. I was shocked. I actually just stood there and stared like, well, hey. I've seen some videos circulating of the same kind of thing happening and with the guys it's worse and i've seen another one where they were literally being dragged out of the train like they had a chance to get into the cabins but then they were dragged out the whole way not just by the door but they were dragged out hey what what you all see taking place here is that that illusion that the white men have put on our people it's bursting yep. because christianity and the white men say we all is equal and god god love everybody but when you go to these countries, what's, what you see happening is black people, our people being treated like crap. You understand? And these same people is Christians, man. Okay, so that bubble, that illusion that the white man put on us is bursting. Okay, that's what you see happening. She getting a rude, our people is getting a rude, a, a rude awakening to, to the white man being the devil, our enemies. These people hate us. Yeah, but then she say, I was shocked. After all history, you were shocked. She's shocked because she's Christian. Yeah. Because in Christianity, they teach them that lie. Yep. We're all equal. We all love each other. That's a lie. Yeah, this is why you see our people talking about let's pray for them. No, let's pray for the destruction. Exactly. Yes, that's what we should do. Exactly. Pray for the destruction. More bomb, please. <laughs> hey, give me Job 5 and 8. Actually, uh, 5 and 11. I'll start there. Job chapter 5, verse 11. To set up on high those that be low. So the Lord's purpose regarding us is to set up on high those that be low. Right now we're low, but he's going to set us up on high. Go ahead. That those which mourn may be exalted to safety. That those which mourn, we're the ones mourning now. Like our sisters and brothers over in, that's in the Ukraine. They were they're mourning. Okay. Under the spell of witchcraft. Mourning that we, we may be exalted to safety, God. He disappointed the devices of the crafty. See that? He, God disappointed the devices of the crafty. Remember what we read in Psalms 83? They were the crafty, go ahead. So that their hands cannot perform their enterprise. So that their hands cannot perform their enterprise. Uh, put that up next to the dollar bill. Read that real quick. Look at the back of the one dollar bill. What do those words mean in Latin? Anuit coeptus. Anuit coeptus. Our enterprise is now a success. Our enterprise is now a success. Go ahead. Novus ordo seclorum. Seclorum. A new order of the ages. A new world order. Go ahead. The all-seeing eye and the pyramid 
was and still is the symbol of the Illuminati, a secret society formed by a secret, uh, a secret cable of Freemasons. Cabal, Cabal of Freemasons. Mm -hmm. They went on to become skull and bones. And now what is commonly referred to as the New World Order. Now give me the dollar bill. So a new coeptus, our enterprise success. Enterprise success. But if you notice, like at the bottom it says 1776, it's not really finished yet. There's still more. This is why they're pushing the population control and things of that nature. Trying to exterminate us. That's what they want to do. But they want to do it secretly. Novus Ordo Seclorum, New World Order, okay? So when we go back to Job 5 and verse, what verse was that again? Verse 12? Verse 12. Go ahead. Yes, sir. He disappointed the devices of the crafty so that their hands cannot perform their enterprise. So the Lord said he's going to disappoint them. They're not going to finish what they're attempting to do to our people. Go ahead. He taketh the wise in their own craftiness. Mm -hmm. And the counsel of the forward is carried headlong. To be carried headlong means you crack your head and die. That's what the Lord's plan for them is. Come on. They meet with darkness in the daytime. When it's high noon, God said, I'm going to bring them down. Go ahead. And grope in the noonday as in the night. Uh -huh. But he saveth the poor from the sword. See that? That's our people. He said, but he saveth the poor from the sword so what we read in revelation 12 about the dragon went to make war with the remnant of his seed which keep the commandments and of the testament of jesus the lord said listen i'm gonna save you i'm gonna save a remnant of you i'm not gonna let all of y'all die a remnant is going to be saved read that again but he saveth the poor from the sword from their mouth from their lies god and from the hand of the mighty come on so the poor have hope so brothers sisters we have hope go ahead and iniquity stoppeth her mouth. And iniquity shall shut the hell up. Go ahead. Behold, happy is the man whom God corrected. I want y'all to pay close attention to that part. Happy is the man whom God correcteth. God corrects us for a reason. Give me that in Romans 5. We're coming back here. Romans 5 and 3. The correction has a purpose behind it. You might think you are at the pinnacle of your strength. The Lord says, no, you're not there yet. Read that. Romans chapter 5, verse 3. And not only so, but we glory in tribulations also, knowing that tribulation worketh patience, and patience experience, mm -hmm. and experience hope, and hope maketh not a shame. So when we go through hardships, hard times, that ain't the Lord uh, hating us. That's the Lord trying to build us. Give me that Sirach 2. And verse 5, he's trying to build us into the perfect man of Israel, the perfect woman of Israel. Sirach, Ecclesiasticus chapter 2, verse 5. For gold is tried in the fire. We are the gold tried in the fire of adversity, God. And acceptable men in the furnace of adversity. See that? And acceptable men in the furnace of adversity. We must go through adversity to be built, to prepare ourselves, our souls, our minds for what is to come. So the Lord said, I got to put you through some stuff right now. Because if the enemy comes now, you all go back to worshiping white Jesus. I hope you all understand it. Go back, go back, go back, go back. Job 5. Job chapter 5, verse, seven, verse uh, 17. 17. Come on. Behold. Happy is the man whom God correcteth. My wife left me. My husband left me. Oh, I got, I got, uh, I'll put out of my house. So what? Endure it. The Lord's trying to build you. Oh, I'm sick. The Lord's trying to build, build you into something. He's trying to make a new creature out of you. That only comes through tribulation. That only comes through trials. Everybody understand that? Read on. Therefore despise not thou the chastening of the Almighty. Therefore despise not thou the chastening of the Almighty. Come on. For he maketh sore and bindeth up. Mm. He woundeth and his hands make whole. Come on. He shall deliver thee in six troubles. He shall deliver thee in six troubles. Those are the six trumps you'll read about okay, in Revelation. Yea, in seven there shall no evil touch thee. Yea, in seven there shall no evil touch thee. Give me that precept in Revelation eleven fifteen, for the seven. Here's the precept. Revelation chapter eleven, verse fifteen. And the seventh angel sounded, and there were great voices in heaven, saying, 
the kingdoms of this world are become the kingdoms of our Lord and of his Christ. And he shall reign forever and ever. For he now go on back. R R Job 5, 19. One more again. He shall deliver thee in six troubles. He shall deliver thee in six trumps. That's tribulation. Go ahead. Yea, in seven. When the seventh trump is sounded, there shall no evil touch the thee. The kingdom's going to be established. Go ahead. In famine. In he famine. Shall, he shall redeem thee from death. He shall redeem us from death. And in war. And in war. From the power of the sword. From the power of the sword. Go ahead. Thou shalt be hid from the scourge of the tongue. Thou shalt be hid from the scourge of the tongue. That's their lies. Go ahead. Neither shalt thou be afraid of destruction when it cometh. When destruction comes, brothers and sisters, when we see the missiles come, the Bible says, what? Thou sh it said, read, neither shalt thou be afraid of destruction when it comes. Go ahead. At destruction and famine thou shalt Can we laugh. look at someone? Hey, hey, give me the, give me, give me, what? Raise it up. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. Raise it up. Let me look. I want, no, 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 no. Uh, lower it. Let me look. Lower it. Raise it up so I can see. Right after the, yeah, over the top left. Yeah, yeah, just, just hit me there. Hit me there. Just, just go from there. This, read it again. And go on through. Verse 21. Thou shalt be hid from the scourge of the tongue. Neither shalt thou be afraid of destruction when it cometh. At destruction and famine, thou shalt laugh. At destruction and famine, thou shalt laugh. Now you see here on the screen, you see a famine. There's going to come a time when we see the missiles coming, because we're going to be in the midst of that. Like it says in Psalms 91, a thousand shall fall at thy side, and ten thousand at your right hand, but it shall not come near thee. This is what it's talking about. This is what it's talking about. That's that remnant of brothers and sisters that's alive at that time. I hope y'all understand that. I hope y'all understand that. Come on, where we at? Verse 22. Uh -huh. At destruction and famine thou shalt laugh. Uh -huh. Neither shalt thou be afraid of the beasts of the earth. Mm -hmm. For thou shalt be in league with the stones of the field. This is the kingdom, go ahead. And the beasts of the field shall be at peace with thee. Uh -huh. And thou shalt know that thy tabernacle shall be in peace. And thou shalt visit thy habitation. And shall not sin. You see that part right there? And shall not sin. Give me that precept in Isaiah 60, 21. And shall not sin. Isaiah chapter 60. Wait, 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 wait. Let me get it. Go ahead. Verse 21. Mm -hmm. Thy people also shall be all righteous. Y'all see that? Thy people also shall be all righteous. Go ahead. They shall inherit the land forever. Mm -hmm. The branch of my planting. The work of my hands, that I may be glorified. Read. A little one shall become a thousand. We're going to have a lot of kids. Go ahead. And a small one, a strong nation. Watch what he says. I, the Lord, will hasten it in his time. The Lord going to make that happen fast. Happen faster and faster. Go on back. Watch this. It ain't over yet. Back to ver Job 5 and verse uh, 24 again. Verse 24. And thou shalt know that thy tabernacle shall be in peace. Mm -hmm. And thou shalt visit thy habitation. And shalt not sin. Thy people shall be all righteous. Read. Thou shalt know also that thy seed shall be great. See that? Thy seed shall be great. And thine offspring as the grass of the earth. And thy offspring as the grass of the earth. We're going to have a whole. Job is saying the same thing Isaiah prophesied about. He ain't study. He ain't make no, no if, ands, or buts. It's saying the same thing. Hey, give me a picture of the kingdom. Put that kingdom up there. That one right there. Put that up on the screen. That's what, it, that's what Job is talking about. Well, actually, you know who this is? This one of his friends running their mouth, talking about prophetic prophecy, though. Now, give me Job 20 and 22. We're almost done. Job, Job chapter 20. 20, verse 22. Uh-huh. In the fullness of his sufficiency. In, in the fullness of his sufficiency. Talk about Esau. Remember it said, our enterprise of success. God said, I will uh, disappoint the crafty so that their hands cannot perform their enterprise. It's saying the same thing here in verse 22. Read. In the fullness of his sufficiency, he shall be in straits. Mm -hmm. He going to catch hell. Every hand of the wicked shall come upon him. When it says every hand of the wicked shall be upon him, it's talking about NATO and all the other nations. Go ahead. When he is about to fill his belly, 
God shall cast the fury of his wrath upon him uh -huh. and shall rain it upon him while he is eating. While he is eating. Now watch this. Here come. He shall flee from the iron weapon. He shall put it on the screen. He shall flee from the iron. Uh, that's the iron weapon. The same weapon that Oppenheimer came up with. Read it again. He shall flee from the iron weapon and the bow of steel shall strike him through. The bow of steel shall strike him through. Go ahead. It is drawn and cometh out of the body. It is drawn and cometh out of the body. Not that one yet. Go back. Not that yet. <laughs> Go back to the. Yes. Read it again. He shall flee from the iron weapon uh -huh. and the bow of steel shall strike him through. Here come. It is drawn and cometh out of the body. The body is talking about is the earth. Many of these missiles are in the earth in their silos. Go ahead. Yea, the glittering sword. That's the glittering sword. Go ahead. Cometh out of his gall. Uh-huh. Terrors are upon him. Terrors are upon him. Come on. All darkness shall be hid in his secret place. Uh-huh. A fire not blown shall consume him. A fire not... You ain't got to blow when them nuclear weapons hit. That's not the type of fire you... <sighs> to blow it. The, the fan, to grow. This is nuclear fire. Go ahead. It shall go ill with him that is left in his tabernacle. See that? It shall go ill with him that is left in his tab. Anybody left here in America is going to go ill with him. Go ahead. The heaven shall reveal his iniquity. The, hey, give me the next picture. The heaven shall reveal his iniquity. Go ahead. And the earth shall rise up against him. The earth shall rise up against him. Go ahead. The increase of his house shall depart. The, give me the next picture. Come on. And now, his, there's going to be total destruction here. I hope you men are going to see that. Total destruction. Go ahead. And his goods shall flow away. In see the, that? And his goods shall flow away. In the day of his wrath. In the day of his wrath. This is the portion of a wicked man. See that? This is the portion of a wicked man. Go ahead. From God. From God. And the heritage appointed unto him. My God. Give me Jeremiah 49. We're almost done. We're almost done. Let me look. Let me look. Let me make sure. Yes, we're almost done. We're almost done. Jeremiah 49, 7, please. Jeremiah chapter 49, verse 7. Mm -hmm. Concerning Edom. Concerning who? Edom. Concerning Edom. These are all your Caucasians. Go ahead. Thus saith the Lord of Thus hosts. Thus saith who? The Lord of hosts. Uh -huh. Is wisdom no more in Teman? Is wisdom no more in Teman? Because Teman... Germany. They had a lot of their top scientists that came here to Babylon to build up Babylon. Go ahead. Is counsel perished from the prudent? Uh huh. Is their wisdom vanished? Flee ye, turn back, dwell deep, O inhabitants of Dedan. Mm -hmm. For I will bring the calamity. Hey, hey, hey. when it says, Oh, in what verse you at? Verse 8. Verse 8. O inhabitants of Dedan. Get Isaiah 21, 13 so we can understand D-Dan. Y'all better write this down. Isaiah chapter 21, verse 13. The burden upon Arabia. In the forest in Arabia shall ye lodge. O ye traveling compa companies of D-Denim. D-Denim, that's D-Dan right there going back to verse 8. Flee ye, turn back, dwell deep, O inhabitants of D-Dan. Come on. For I will bring the calamity of Esau upon him. He said, I'm going to bring Esau's calamity on you, you Arabs. Go ahead. The time that I will visit him. Come on. If great gatherers come to thee, would they not leave some gleaning grapes? Mm -hmm. If thieves by night, they will destroy till they have enough. Right. But I have made Esau bare. I have uncovered his secret places. His secret places, his, his secret meetings, his secret councils, his underground bunkers, things of that nature. Go ahead. And he shall not be able to hide himself. Esau's not going to be able to hide himself on this day. Come on. His seed is spoiled. Mm -hmm. And his brethren and his neighbors. And he is not. See that? His seed is spoiled and his brethren and his neighbors. And he is not meaning he's going to be destroyed, eliminated. That's what the Bible says. Come on. Leave thy fatherless children. I will preserve them alive. Why would God preserve their fatherless children alive? For slavery. Captivity. Go ahead. And let thy widows trust in me. Uh huh. For thus saith the Lord: Behold, they whose judgment was not to drink of the cup. Esau. Esau's judgment. He didn't want to drink the cup of the Lord. Go ahead. 
have assuredly drunk they shall surely drink the cup of the lord all the judgments shall come upon them go ahead and art thou he that shall all together go unpunished god says are you he that shall all together go unpunished go ahead thou shalt not go unpunished god says to esau you shall not go unpunished but thou shalt surely drink you want to drink the judgments of god esau come on for i have sworn by myself saith the lord that Bozrah, Bozrah is the capital city of Edom. Go ahead. Shall become a desolation, mm -hmm. a reproach, a waste, and a curse. Uh -huh. And all the cities thereof shall be perpetual waste. Read. I have heard a rumor from the Lord, and an ambassador is sent unto the heathen, saying, Gather ye together, and come against her, and rise up to the battle. All the nations, primarily NATO, is going to rise up against America. Babylon. Go ahead. For lo, I will make thee small among the heathen and despised, despised. America's doing so much wickedness in the earth. All nations are going to go, look at this. We got to take this nation down. That's why they make the American dollar strong and all other dollar currencies weak. Go ahead. And despised among men. Come on. Thy terribleness hath deceived thee and the pride of thine heart. O thou that dwellest in the clefts of the rock. O thou that dwellest in the clefts of the rock. Go ahead, Caucasus Mountains. That holdest the height of the hill, uh -huh. though thou shouldest make thy nest as high as the eagle. They make their nest as high as the eagle. Remember, they landed on the moon and said, the eagle has landed. Do you, a, do you have a picture of that for me? IT? <coughs> IT? Do you have a picture of the, the moon landing? Moon landing? Come on. Under images. Go ahead, put it on the screen. This is the, put it on the screen. This is the moon landing when they said the eagle has landed. So we're talking about America right here. Where, where you at, Cap? Uh, the middle of verse 16. Come on. Though thou shouldest make thy nest as high as the eagle, I will bring thee down from thence, saith the Lord. Read. Also Edom shall be a desolation. Everyone that goeth by it shall be astonished and shall hiss at all the plagues thereof. Uh -huh. As in the overthrow of Sodom and Gomorrah. Why does he say as in the overthrow of Sodom and Gomorrah? What is America pushing? Same-sex relations, same-sex marriage, transgenderism. This place shall be destroyed just like Sodom and Gomorrah was destroyed. Verse 18 again. As in the overthrow of Sodom and Gomorrah and the neighbor cities thereof, saith the Lord, no man shall abide there, neither shall a son of man dwell in it. Mm -hmm. Behold, he shall come up like a lion from the swelling of Jordan against the habitation of the strong. But I will suddenly make him run away from her. And who is a chosen man that I may appoint over her? The Lord is the only one, go ahead. For who is like me? He said, who is like me? Go ahead. And who will appoint me the time? Who's going to tell me when destruction's coming on Edom? Go ahead. And who is that shepherd that will stand before me? What shepherd? What warrior can stand before me? Watch this. Therefore hear the counsel of the Lord that he hath taken against Edom. God's counsel is against Esau. Edom. Go ahead. And his purposes. Listen good. That he hath purposed against the inhabitants of Teman. The inhabitants of Teman. That's their scientists here. Go ahead. Surely the Watch least. This. Surely the least of the flock. Watch. Write this down. That's the Israelis. Modern day Israel, read it again, surely. Surely the least of the flock shall draw them out. So when Israel goes to war, it's going to draw America into the war. Read it again, surely. Surely the least of the flock shall draw them out. Hey, put some pictures up on the screen there with the helicopters and all that. I want them helicopters. Yeah, right. Go ahead. Read that again. Surely the least of the flock shall draw them out. Surely he shall make their habitations desolate Surely with them. Surely he shall make their habitations desolate with them. Obadiah 1 verse 7, please. We're almost done. We're almost done. only got like three more verses. Obadiah, Obadiah, Obadiah. Obadiah. 7 through 10. Obadiah verse 7. Read. Obadiah verse 7. All the men of thy confederacy. All the men of thy confederacy. That's NATO. That's the EU. Go ahead. 
have brought thee even to the border. They've brought America even to the border. The men that were at peace with thee. That's the evidence. The men that were at peace with thee, their allies. Have deceived thee. Have deceived thee. Go ahead. And prevailed against thee. And preve That's showing you prophetically, NATO's going to turn against the United States of America. Go ahead. They that eat thy bread have laid a wound See that part? thee. They that eat thy bread, that's the EU. They, eat, they share in everything with America. They that eat their bread with thee, what? Have laid a wound under thee. Laid a trap under thee. Go ahead. There is none understanding in him. There's no understanding in America. All of, all, I want to just go down to verse 10. That was it? V verse 8. Yes, sir. That was it on verse 7. I want to go down to verse 10. Verse 10. Thy violence I'll, against, seven, for thy violence. Listen, listen. We're going to read 7 through 10. Yes, sir. Verse 8. Shall I not in that day, saith the Lord, even destroy the wise men out of Edom? See that? The wise men is teeming. That's here. Their wise men are their scientists, their astrologers, things of that nature. Those same scientists and their kids that came here to make America great, the Lord said, I'm going to destroy, destroy your wise men. Okay? And understanding out of, the, out of the mouth of Esau uh -huh. and thy mighty men, O teeming shall be dismayed mm. to the end that every one of the mount of esau may be cut off by slaughter now watch was that 10 no sir that was verse 9 read verse 10 for thy violence against thy brother now Jacob. he's going to tell you why god's doing it why what was the reason for thy violence against thy brother jacob for the violence they did against their brother jacob where jacob go ahead shame shall cover thee shame shall cover esau edom and thou shalt be cut off forever and thou shalt be cut off forever now new testament precept here's the precept revelation 17 let's start at 16 and read down revelation chapter 17 verse 16 and the 10 horns which thou sawest upon the beast the 10 horns is nato go ahead these shall hate the whore they shall hate america america's the whore and shall make her desolate shall make her desolate and naked and naked and shall eat her flesh and burn her with fire. They're going to burn it. Hey, can you, you put, put some things on the screen? Come on, man. They're going to burn. Read that part again because I didn't get the impact. Read it again. And shall make her desolate and naked and shall eat her flesh and burn her with fire. They're going to burn America with fire. Go ahead. For God has put it in their hearts to fulfill his will. God put it in their hearts to fulfill his will. And to agree. Uh-huh. And give their kingdom unto the beast. So they're going to support America for a limited time. Go ahead. Until the words of God shall be fulfilled. Until our prophesying in this earth is finished. Then war is going to break out. Destruction. Go ahead. And the woman which thou sawest. And in case you weren't, who, who is that whore? Go ahead. Is that great city which reigneth over the kings of the earth. Mm -hmm. Now from there, watch this. Revelation 6 and 12. We almost done. We almost done. I know I keep saying that, but we are. Let me, look. Let, me, let me look. Let me look. Do I want to get that? Yes, go ahead. Revelation 6, 12. Revelation chapter 6, verse 12. And I beheld when he had opened the sixth seal. And lo, there was a great earthquake. And the sun became black as sackcloth of hair. And the moon became as blood. And the stars of heaven fell unto the earth. Even as a fig tree casteth her untimely figs. When she is shaken of a mighty wind. That's destruction. Hey, y'all could put some images of nuclear bombs up there, you know. Yes. Look alive. Come on. And the heaven departed as a scroll. And the heaven departed as a scroll. That's what you're looking at. Go ahead. When it is rolled together. Uh -huh. And every mountain and island were moved out of their places. Mm -hmm. And the kings of the earth. And the kings of the earth. And the great men. And the great men. That's and NATO and all the allies. And the rich men. And the rich men. And the chief captains. And the mighty men. And every bondman. And every free man. Hid themselves in the dens. In the rocks of the mountains. Uh -huh. And said to the mountains and rocks. Fall on us. And hide us from the face of him that sitteth on the throne. Yes, these are the, this is what they're going to hide in. Go ahead, put them on. Go across the screen. Go ahead. This is what they're going to hide in. Read that part again. And said to the mountains and rocks, fall on us and hide us from the face of him that sitteth on the throne and from the wrath of the Lamb. 
for the great for the great day of his wrath is come. And who shall be able to stand? Last scripture, last scripture, last scripture, Zephaniah 2 and 1. I just love it so much. I just like, I just want to read it. I just love this scripture. Zephaniah chapter 2, verse 1. I want all y'all to pay very close attention to this. Go ahead. Gather yourselves together. This is for you men and women that sit at home. The Bible says gather yourselves together. Come on. Yea, gather together. Oh, nation not desired. We're the nation not desired. You saw what's going on in U Ukraine. You see what happened in America. We're the nation not desired. Go ahead. Before the decree bring forth. Before the decree. Before God's judgment brings forth. Go ahead. Before the day passes the chaff. Before the day passes. Like, put them pictures up right there. Before the, this is gathering together. We must gather ourselves together. Before the day of destruction comes. That's the day of the chaff. We must gather ourselves together read before the fierce anger of the lord come upon before you. the fierce anger of the lord brings forth was that it no sir go ahead before the day of the lord's anger come upon you before the read that part again before the day of the lord's anger come upon you read seek ye the lord all ye meek of the earth which have wrought his judgment seek righteousness seek meekness it may be ye shall be hid in the day of the Lord's anger. I don't know about y'all, but I want to be hid in the day of the Lord's anger. Because when the day of the Lord's anger comes, there's going to be a mighty destruction. And after that destruction, when the kingdom is set up, put that on the screen and give me Revelation 3.9. This is what's going to happen to all these Nazis and all these Edomites. Read the scripture, Revelation 3.9. Revelation chapter 3 verse 9. Behold, I will make them of the synagogue of Satan which say they are Jews and are not, but do lie. Behold, I will make them to come and worship before thy feet mm -hmm. and to know that I have loved thee. So y'all hear that? Twelve tribes? Worldwide. Twelve tribes? Worldwide. Never give up? Never give in. Never give up? Never give in. And with that, we say shalom. <laughs> hey, 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 IT, play that video. You know I want that video. Y'all got it. Hope. It's called Hope. Y'all should have a download. It should have already been uploaded to y'all. It's called Hope. It's from the brothers and sisters in London. Come on. It's, called, it's on YouTube. Right there. Right there. That's it right there. Pay close attention. Volume! Always keep the feast and remembrance Praising our God with a song when we're present Glorious God's like a chain with a pendant Spirit of joy I receive so I'm sending Spread it to my bros, that's my fam Rejecting the truth that you know we can have You know what's my circle, the gold and the purple We act on God's laws, yeah it's more than just verbal So just raise your hand Christ is coming down to save the fam Remember the days of old, Christ is coming down to save you soon. I know the saints must roll, be patient, be waiting though. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, the earth will grow. I said the earth will grow. Is a new day. We've come a long way. I was unhappy, but now I'm happy. I know my place. I wear a skin. I now know who I am and where I need to be. I'm filled with joy. The bloodline of a royal priesthood. First Peter two and nine. Who would have believed? Raise your hands, 
things must roll We patiently wait though That the kingdom come That we'll be down the earth will grow Good stuff right there. through with that song listen that song when you're going through things them is the kind of music you want to listen to you know you're going you know it, 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 it revamp your spirit just get you feeling good you understand so shout out to iuic uk that was a beautiful song man you understand you all keep bringing the fire man <laughs> Hey, we want to we want that shirt too. Instead of that wolf pack shirt they got. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We need, yeah, we need the wolf pack shirt, man. That shirt is bad, man. Send it. You know, we might be converting bishop to the wolf pack. You understand? So, brother, send us the shirt, all right? Get one for Abiel too, okay? <laughs> uh, any announcements, captains? That's right. Any announcements? Okay. All right. Y'all give another hand clap. All praise to the Most High for an excellent class from the Bishop. All praises to the Most High. All right. Let's play the first one from. IUIC, New York, Connecticut, New Jersey, Philly, and Boston. Lovely. I love it. That's what we need unity all over the world. Here we go! Here we go! Yeah, here we go! All praise to the most high, IUIC schools, New York, Connecticut, New Jersey, Philly, and Boston, united to blitz two major events in Long Island and Connecticut this weekend. 
the Lord gave the word and many flyers went out. Great was the company of those that published it. Let's go to the next one, IUIC Dallas. I want y'all to know these men are doing a wonderful job out here. We need more men like these. From the dead, ain't that a God move? Heard the words of the Lord, he made a God move. Ran my sinews to my bones and had a flesh too. Then brutal breath up in my body, made a God move. Do we seem like a hate group? No. Cause there's a lot of things going around saying we're a hate group. Did you get that from us? No, y'all ain't no whole hate group. Y'all the, y'all the group that Jesus got out here doing this in these last days. <laughs> oh, That's what I'm talking about. Say, thank you, y'all sir. be blessed. That's right. IUIC Dallas had boots on the ground at the annual Divine Nine Greek Festival. The word went out strong, the sheep were edified, and the Most High got another victory. Go to IUIC Dallas YouTube channel to check out more content. Let's go to the next one from IUIC Gastonia. I've been on this road too long. I'm making my way back home. I was young, did a lot of things wrong. I'm making my way back home. Why not? Pull up. Shalom Israel, Most High Christ Bless. I'm Captain Soraya here with my officers. Of the year. And Officer Azaria. And we had an opportunity to come here to, as you see behind us, and all praise the Most High, it was successful. And I want y'all to come back for a couple more series. Yeah. You know? It was very receptive, and they actually did a podcast that we was able to bring out the truth according to the Bible, who we are. We are the Israelites that the Bible speaks of, the so-called Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, and to show our people that they have to come back and repent by keeping God's law, statutes, commandments in the faith of Christ, and let them know that they are the children of Israel, the so-called Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. Keep us in your prayers, and with that, we say shalom. Shalom. IUIC Gastonia, North Carolina, had a church sit-down presentation. Uh, with Pastor Alice and Deacon Holt to share the true gospel, identifying the biblical Israelites of today that would that's, that was discontinued from their heritage and how they must return and repent by keeping of God's biblical laws and the faith of our Lord and Savior, the Black Messiah Jesus Christ. Stay tuned. Full documentary coming soon. Let's go to the next one. I U I C Jackson. My name is Captain Gutterlife. This is Officer Badiah. Yeah. We're the head man of the uh, IUIC Jackson branch. The so-called blacks, uh -huh. uh, mm -hmm. the so-called Native Americans, right. the so-called Hispanics. Yeah. Those are our people. Right. And our objective is to teach them that um, the reason that we're in this situation that yeah. we're in is not because of somebody did something to us. The reason we in this situation yeah. is because we broke God's commandments. Yeah. Preaching law. I don't preach law. I preach race. Uh, so you know you 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 believe that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, no doubt about it. Yes, sir. If the scripture about the beard and the scripture about the tattoo is in the same verse, that means that means the beard is applicable too. I don't agree with that. Okay. <laughs> we we not asking you to convert to this. Right. But we do know this, this is not a religion. You believe in the trend? No. Uh, yeah, I believe in the trend. Whatever you are now, I think you're a real good brother in God. Yes, sir. Okay. Pray to God and I ask. If what I'm telling you is true. I gave up everything for this. Right. So I'm not going to ask the Lord to open up my understanding about a doctrine I know is not biblical. IUIC Jackson, Mississippi, was able to schedule a sit down uh, with a missionary Baptist pastor who does acknowledge that he is Israel. We had a good discussion about the solutions our community needs. Although we walked away not agreeing about topics such as the law and salvation, we appreciate the opportunity to spread the gospel with community leaders. The seed was planted, and hopefully the Lord gives the increase. Let's go to the next one, IUIC Oklahoma. I've actually really wanted to have a conversation like this because I've, of course, seen uh, you all out um, and I always wondered, okay, I, I hear what you're saying, who are these people? Hey, we're not here for debate, we just want to present the information and if you, what you see is what you see and if you don't, hey, we're not here to force anything. I'm frustrated 
with how some approach God. You take it as being offensive as how brothers on the corner trying to tell people, hey, let's come back to God's laws and do what God said. Uh, Paul was not a meek and mild type of brother. Paul was in the Our forefathers are in this Bible. We must come back to our heritage as well as keeping God's commandments and faith in the Son. So how do you deal with people that are unfamiliar with and just want to write you off the We have adopted customs and traditions that are not biblical. I admire um, whenever I see uh, someone out there preaching God's word. You have to believe on Christ and you have to apply the law. Yeah. We got to come back to this foundation. I agree. Someone yeah. may be at the end of their rope and needing mm -hmm. uh, that, that, that line and need the truth uh, to be told to them. When the Lord calls, we move. Deacon Abiel and the captains of IUIC Oklahoma City sat down with a leader of the community of the church community in Wichita, Kansas, to express the need for God's laws in the black community. Israel rise. Let's go to the next one. Shalom, Savior. I am looking forward to enduring this truth with you. I pray the Most High is showing you favor by giving me to you. I feel blessed and honored to have you as my Savior, my Lord. I have fasted and begged the Lord to give me the spirit to be your aid because I see you striving in your youth to keep the laws. And I pray to rejoice you and to be your pillar of rest as we become aged together. Your rib, Tana. She comes from my tribe. Thou madest Adam and gavest him Eve, his wife, for an helper and stay. Of them come mankind. And thou hast said, It is not good that man should be alone. Let us make unto him an aid like to himself. And now, O Lord, I take not this my sister for lust, but uprightly, therefore mercifully ordained that we may become aged together. And she said with him, Amen. Marriage is the foundation of nation building, and what was ordained in the heavens has been established on the earth. As IUIC continues to create and show the world righteous marriages, congratulations to the house of Officer Amoza. All right, IUIC events. You want to know how to piss a hater off? Do you want to know how to piss a hater off? Let me show you. Dream to me, we step on the scene clean. All the haters ain't really trying to be with me. I'm thinking, how can it defeat me? If I'm strong on the low and ain't meet me. Jordan drop fire and BC. If you ain't know that my name is Nimi. I get lit and I anchor a greatest. My brother's about to get hit. Don't look at my wrist. Oh, you can go blind, you're taking a risk. I'm filthy rich. Fire. The sit down with Prime Minister will be available to view on IUIC events, YouTube channel, and IUIC TV. Hey, he wanted to know, he said, who is this group turning my island upside down? That's what he said. That's what he said, yes. So, hey, the spirit was there. So, we ain't got time arguing about corners. We doing bigger and better than Lord. The spirit of the Lord is with us. That's right. You understand that? The hell is this? All praise to the most High. We got another one. Let's go to the next one. Give me that name again. Bishop Nathaniel. 
Fire, fire, fire. IUIC blitzed the Bahamas and showed how we are taking over the world from corner to countries. 12 tribes worldwide. Y'all know the, the vice mission. president just went over there. Yep. This week, Kamala Harris went over there to push the gay agenda. Yep. You can't make this stuff up. Go ahead. Let's get some more. Let's get some more. Corners hey, to Trump. countries. Israel, most high in Christ, bless. Bishop Nathaniel here. We're here in the Bahamas. I got Deacon Malachi, Deacon Lava, Bishop Kenai over there. Mighty men of the Most High. We met some people here so far. It's a big problem on the island of Bahamas. A large crime rate is going up. A lot of Levites here, Benjamites. We want to meet some people, do some teaching out here. Unite our people as one. And we give all praises to the Most High and His glorious Son, the King of Kings, Lord of Lords, Jesus the Christ. All right, so Israel, we're going to teach this gospel like it's never been taught before. And Lord's will is rain stop. You're praying for us, all right? Shalom. My name is Daniel Thompson. I'm the Secretary General for the National Congress of Trade Union of the Bahamas. And so we are, we are delighted to have invited the House of Israel, which consists of young working men, to be a part of this parade, to celebrate with workers. And I think it's important when I look at these young men marching, they could have been involved in so many other nefarious activities, but they chose to be a part of something that's very constructive and in the work of the Lord. And so we're excited to have them a part of this parade, this Labor Day 2023. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We're going to unify the people. Don't worry. Everybody's going to be good. Crime's going to go down. Go as well. We're going to send them to prayers today. Okay? Okay All praises. All praises. All right. I see my life flyer any day. Any day. They can't touch you all. They can't touch you all. I know this flyer. We pulling these young men out of the gangs. Okay? Cleaning their lives up. Take care of your wife. Take care of your children according to the word of God. I'm excited. I'm elated. These guys, these are kings. These are ordinary black men. These are kings. We're the Israelites of the Bible school. So we're going to pull our people out of these gangs. Our women are going to become mothers and wives, not whores and harlots anymore. That hoochie mom, all that's going to stop. God save the Lord. We're going to unite up people for the second coming of the King of Kings and Lord of Lords. We're unified. We're unified team. Seems positive. Us. We're, we're driven by seeing change in lives, right. making these young men into fathers, into husbands, or wives or women into mothers, into into wives, and that's what that's what compels. That's the reason why we find ourselves. We go to the parts of the countries. We went to Trinidad and Africa, different places where people will not go. We are a particular people. We are the chosen people. That's right. Bishops, deacons, captains, and the army of God all on one island. IUIC took over the Bahamas in the spirit of the Lord. From corners to countries. Let's go to the next one. The Sons of Thunder. Your vision, the law how we making decisions. Uh, high mind, hard body, prophets, God 
toss, got the earth rocking. Dr. Killers quit to get it popping. You'll never be able to stop it. Watch yeah. this. Yo, yo, what you doing, man? Let the thing rock, yo. Yo, what's wrong with you, man? Let the thing play, man. I don't care. We want to watch the whole thing. What the hell is wrong with you all, man? <laughs> Premier into my 12, Israel on the rise. Represent this one for the tribes. In my head, dreams of eat them dying. This that you've been want that smoke. Sons of thunder, bring that fire. Yeah, I got a lot on my plate. Better be sure I'ma eat it. He told me go out to the sheep. And you better know I'ma feed them. Yeah, 12 by 12, Israel on the rise. Represent this one for the tribes. You better move, move, move if you ain't got work for the kingdom. kingdom. Pass me my sword so I can go ham. Go get a pig on a demon. Woo. I think twice before I speak. You know them niggas be scheming. Yo, yo, foundation yo. built on a rock. Then we gon' drop it on eat them. And who would've Ooh. thought we would win it? Uh, if we fell back from the Senate. Yo, win it all in my lap. Uh, but y'all like song take engine. Oh, uh, my God, black like Wesley. Why uh, these nations keep trying to test me? Uh, I got a heart and it's full of aggression. And get them to go just like Messi. Go to gates without naming and hit it. Uh, yeah. If they don't like it, be hit them. Uh, break them to pieces and shred them. Make sure they know that it's pressure, pressure, pressure. Uh, you want the Truth, but here's the lecture. Doctor, yeah. get by this on one called a stretcher. Look for the king to come from the heavens. 12 like 1 plus 11. Go. Yeah, 12 by 12, Israel on the rise. Represent this one for the tribes. In my head, dreams of eat them, dying. This that you been want that smoke. Sons of thunder, bring that fire. Yeah, I got a lot on my plate. Better be sure I'ma eat it. He told me go out to the sheep. And you better know I'ma feed them. Drop bone from the neck to the hip to the thigh bone. Ain't no belly to drop, we gon' rise on them. It's the body of your class, it's alive, homie. I'm thinking you holding the secret. Cat at the back, you can stop it, we seen it. Blacks and Hispanics were born for the kingdom. You tried to mislead them, them lies that you tell, it's gon' cost you your freedom. We want the smoke, we challenge your boots on the ground. We alive and we standing up. Today I got time, we pressing you. We ain't gon' stop and get tired. We got stamina, how you gon' stop what we know? My people been mad, they won't smoke. This get back gon' keep us afloat. In these scriptures, it's murder, she wrote, whoa. Used to be blind. blind, now I can see with my mind. Scriptures they open my eyes, and now it's just pressure, pressure, pressure. pressure. My people about it, we really out here. The promise gon' let you know. We got next, we the best, we won't woe. How they gon' stop us when we got the ghosts? Holy smokes! Yeah, twelve by twelve, Israel on the rise. Represent this one for the tribes. In my head, dreams of eat them dying. This that you been want that smoke. Sons of thunder, bring that fire. Yeah, I got a lot on my plate. All right, all right, cut it, cut it right there. We ain't gonna play no more. If you wanna go see the rest on YouTube, on Original Royalty. Doc. What is it? Original yeah, Royalty. Come down, come down, D. Come Everything on, gonna man. be all right, bro. That's my come jam, down. bro. That, that, that thing was That's hot. That's my jam right there, bro. Premiering tonight on Original on Original Royalty Recordings, the, the third video release, Revelation 7 and 4, from Sons of Thunder, from their smash hit third studio album, John 539, available on Original Royalty, all digital stores, and streaming sites. Let's go to the next one, the, the winery, or the, yeah, the date night. City Winery, New York presents the Royalty Duo live on Sunday, July 2nd, 2023 at 730. Get your tickets now and support Original Royalty. Royalty. Sub on to the next one. Subscribe to IUIC TV today. Purchase and stream the multi award winning film Joseph's Dream. Don't forget to visit Matthew213.com to donate and support more biblical productions with accurate representation. Donate to the Curse of Miriam today at Matthew213. Subscribe to IUIC Diaspora. Attention, attention. 
We need all IUIC members and followers to subscribe to IUIC Diaspora on every social media platform, as well as all international channels. We must reach the dispersed of our people. The world of Israel is waiting for you. Isaiah 11, 11 ministries calling all Israelites scattered throughout Arabia, Africa, India, Pakistan, Iran, Italy, Turkey, and all the diaspora. If you believe the scriptures and the truth of the Bible and do not have a school, reach us at iuic.diaspora at israelunite.org to find out how you can help in this mission. 12 tribes worldwide. Yes, it's Tabernacles. I heard Tabernacles. Y'all know what it is. Oklahoma gets it cracking. Hey, what's happening? Shot to Dallas. Easy ride from Cali. We got Memphis in the spirit. Great Northwest knocked out that mileage. Oh, you're wildin'. Yeah, they potted. Uh, random dance, cause I feel like it. Cabbage patch. Running man. Might smoke a risk, cause I be a body. It's this feast. Betty. Can't do it like me. St. Louis down to Mississippi. Yeah, the okie dokie got reach. No beef, no we teach. Houston, Texas with the heat. Five hours and a couple toes. Yeah, Kansas coming with the east. Austin, Texas got a fleet. Praise the Father, face east. We tabernacle, you know where it's headed. We gon' keep it cracking all week. It's Feast of Tabernacles. So we tabernacle. That's right. Feast of Tabernacles right, 2023, the 20th anniversary. We coming back home, y'all. Back to the Okie Doke. Let's get it. That's right. That's right. Hey, all praise to the Most High God. Tabernacle and the Okie Doke is back. Listen, yep. registration is gonna drop Tuesday, Tuesday night. So be on the lookout. Hey, this year, this Tabernacle is gonna be hosted. By your favorite captain, Captain Shamaya, he coming through. Yo, yes, yes. I know. Yes, I know. That's right. <laughs> and yo, his co-host gonna be the other captain from. How come from, he looks startled I, like he didn't know? He does know, bitch. We talked about this. We gonna hook him up too. He gonna have. And his co-host gonna be. Trust me, he did not know. Amaziah. coming too, man. <laughs> All praise. Yeah. Hey, hey, real talk, all jokes aside, this year we're, we're anticipating the largest tabernacles in Oklahoma, so make sure you register. We got to get the park paid for and everything, so everybody don't be slothful. Let's get the business done, man. We're going to have a great time. All praises. All leadership is coming through, y'all, so give it up to the most high God. Hey, is it true that there are no trees in Oklahoma? You got to bring your own tree. You got to bring your own tree if you want some shade. Yeah, we got trees. What you talking about, bro? Hey, so you all start preparing from now. Start saving that little paper, putting everything together. So, you know, it ain't going to be a burden when the time comes. You all can start from now. Put aside a little $10 every week, $5, okay? So when that time come around, everything good, okay? Yo, D, you win it back to Oklahoma, bro? We bringing it back to the Oklahoma. You sure, bro? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Right, man. Let's, and, let's and get no it popping, man. No storms this year, Bishop. Are there ain't going to be no storm this year? No storm. We're prophesying, right. Bishop. We're yeah, praying yeah, I'm going to hold it down by the Spirit of Christ. I'm going to hold it down. <laughs> All praise to the most High. All man. praise to the most High God. All right. That was the last one. Let's break bread and drink wine in honor of our Lord and Savior, Jesus the Christ. This is 1 Corinthians chapter 11, verse 23. For I received of the Lord that which also I delivered unto you, that the Lord Jesus, the same night in which he was betrayed, took bread. And when he had given thanks, he broke it and said, Take, eat, this is my body which is broken for you. This do in remembrance of me. After the same manner also he took the cup when he had supped, saying, This cup is the New Testament in my blood. This do ye as oft as ye drink it in remembrance of me. For as often as ye eat this bread and drink this cup, ye do show the Lord's death till he come. Wherefore, whosoever shall eat this bread and drink this cup of the Lord unworthily shall be guilty of the body and blood of the Lord. But let a man examine himself, and so let him eat of that bread and drink of that cup. For he that eateth and drinketh unworthily, eateth and drinketh damnation to himself, not discerning the Lord's body. 
For this cause, many are weak and sickly among you, and many sleep. In the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus the Christ, we thank you and we pray. Amen. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, man. I see uh, Dick and Isaac still eating the bread. D. Damn, this is good. <laughs> All praise to the most side. Hey, let's give Bishop another round of applause with a fire class. All praises. All right, man, let's bring it home. It's Pentecost. Men Israel, are you ready? Always ready. Are you ready? Always ready. What time is it? Time. What time is it? Time. Who's the king? Right. Who's the king? Right. What color is he? Black. What color is he? Black. Who are we? Who are we? Twelve tribes. Twelve tribes. Unity. 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 Never give up. Never give up. Never give up. Now finally, my brother, be strong in the Lord. His what? His what? His what? His what? Nation is men leading by example. Nation is family. 